What I'd like to do for you now is uh, a really, really simple but very, very healthy salad. Everyone's very health conscious at the moment. We're all thinking about our weight and eating healthily. But it's not just about sort of the five a day and making sure you get enough vegetables. It's also about getting the right balance. So getting the right amount of protein and vegetable and very much getting the right amount of carbohydrate in the diet. So what we're doing here is a really simple warm beef, beetroot and feta cheese um, pasta salad. A bit of a combination of hot and cold flavours here. I'm going to use the, our little baby beetroot here with the, these lovely, lovely lean uh, beef um, tail, fillet tails there. Obviously, any lean piece of beef would do the job really well, but a fillet is very, very lean, so it works very nicely for what we want to do here. Um, but you could use anything really, but this is very cost effective. So I'm just going to cut them into nice thin strips that will cook nice and quickly, just like so. All about the same thickness, so they all cook at about the same time. Like that, that's lovely. Superb, I'll just put that over there out of the way. And then on the back here, I've got a pan that's getting nice and hot, nice non-stick pan. And again, we're trying to keep that fat content down. So what I'm gonna use here is some of our spray oil. So just enough just to coat the bottom, not a lot. We don't want lots and lots in there. And then we get that straight into that nice hot pan. Whoop, try and throw it around a little bit. Here that sizzle, that's what we wanna hear as it gets, hits the pan. I can just pass that to you, Jude. Super, and I'll just wash those hands quickly. Okay. And that's moving around nicely in the pan there. Lovely. You can see it's starting to get a little bit of colour on it, which is what we want. Get them moving like so. And then what I'm going to add to that as well now is our beetroot. I've got these lovely little baby beetroots here. And I just love beetroot and, uh, and beef. It really works well together, this flavouring. So we'll get those moving around in our pan there. Lovely. And they won't take hardly any time at all. I want to keep this quite nice and pink, like so. And they're almost there. See that beetroot is just starting to cover that beef a little bit there as well. Now it's just almost done. Little pinch of cracked black pepper. I'm not going to put any salt in this again. We're trying to keep it healthy. We don't want to put too much salt into it. So just a little bit of pepper. We're going to be putting the feta in there later and the feta is salty. So that's going to give it all the salty flavour we need. Lovely stuff. That's just about how I want it now. Still nice and pink in the middle. So I'll bring that over here. That beetroot's nice and warm. And I think Jude, you've got some nice warm broccoli for me. Just got some little broccoli florets that have already been blanched off and they're still nice and warm. We'll just pop those in there as well and get all that together. Look at that, beautiful colours there. Looking lovely. Oh, you can smell that coming off. Marvellous stuff. Right, then here I've got our pasta. The pasta's actually cold. I've cooked that, kept it nice and al dente. So we're going to get a little bit of a combination of textures and a bit of hot and cold happening as well. So I'll pop that beef and that into there. I'll just pop that pan out of the way. Then I've got a few long spring onions there, just to give it a little bit of a onion flavour as well. A little more cracked black pepper there, just to give it a bit of spiciness. And then here, I've got some virgin olive oil. Not too much, but we just want enough just to make sure we can dress that a little bit. Like so. And then, very importantly, finally, good squeeze of lemon juice, just to really give it a nice dressing and a nice, good, sharp twang that really finishes that off a treat. Lovely. And then we'll just mix that around. And I think, Jude, you've... Uh, Got a nice bowl for me there. Look at that, lovely. So we've got the hot and the cold happening there. We've got some nice mixture of textures. The beetroot's just starting to give that a little pink tinge as well, which is lovely. It's a big main course portion, this one, which is what we want. We want a, a nice, fulfilling meal. Make sure we've got all that beef in there. Don't want to leave any of that beautiful tender beef out. Pop that out of our way. And then just to finish that off, just to finish it however we'd like, our nice barrel aged feta cheese here, aged in oak barrels. We're just going to crumble that across the top like so. That's got a lovely rich flavour. The barrel aged is not quite as salty as the, uh, the normal feta you might be used to, so really good for this dish. Still got a nice salty twang but not quite so, so hard on the palate. A little of that into there and then finally just a couple of little cherry tomatoes for a little bit of colour and a little bit of flavour in there. We'll pop those in there like so. And there you have it, a really, really hearty, but naturally healthy, warm beef, beetroot and feta salad. And if you really want to sort of make sure you're getting your carbs right, etc., on that and the, the nutrition, how you want it to be, if you look on our website, you'll find all the nutritional details and the exact quantities of all the ingredients to get that spot on.